Welcome to Pre-Math. In this video tutorial, we are going to solve this given a logarithmic equation without using a calculator. So let's go ahead and focus on the left-hand side of this given equation, this part. All right. And we are going to use this logarithmic fact, quotient rule. Log of A divided by B is always equal to log of A minus log of B. In our case, this is our 24 is our A and 3 is our B. So this thing could be written as log of 24 divided by 3 with the base 2. And we're going to leave the right hand side as it is log of x with the base 5. And now let's look at this fraction 24 over 3 that could be reduced to 24 divided by 3 is 8. So I am going to write down log of 8 with the base 2 equal to log of x with the base 5. Now let's look at this log of 8 with a base 2. I have just copied it down over here and let's go ahead and tweak it a little bit. We are going to manipulate this 8. 8 could be written as 2 power 3. So I can write this thing log of 2 power 3 with a base 2. And as we can see that 3 is our exponent, so we are going to use this power rule. Log of m power n equal to n log of m. That means this exponent, we are going to drag it to the front. So this could be written as 3 log of 2 with the base 2. And now let's focus on this part, log of 2 with the base 2. 2, we are going to use this fact. This states that if this argument and the base, they are same, it is always equal to 1 since our base and the argument is 2. So that is going to give us 1. So I can write 3 and this thing is 1, 3 times 1 is simply 3. So thus we can see that the log of 8 with a base 2 turns out to be equal to 3. So on the left hand side this part could be now written as 3 equal to log of x with a base 5. And here I have just copied down this part right up here by just putting 3 on the right hand side. That doesn't make any difference. And as we can see that this our problem is in a logarithmic form and we want to convert into exponential form. So we're going to be using this fact converting from logarithmic form to exponential form is we are going to use this one. So this could be written as this one as in this case again once again our base is 5. So we can write this one as 5 power 3 equal to x. And we know that 5 power 3 means that we're going to multiply 5 3 times. That is going to be 125 equal to x. So thus our solution turns out to be x equal to 125 and that is our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.